Alright guys, welcome back to Let's Play Mario & Luigi Superstar Saga. As you can see, my character is not any stronger than they were when we last left off, which means I decided against grinding them. Because, you know, I feel like we'll just do that during. Maybe I'll grind later. I... Whoops! Alright. Okay, guys, I'm back. Don't stop chasing me. Oh, okay. Well, there we go. Uh, let's see, what do we want? Let's give him a BP. Let's stand to use a little more of that. 16, there we go. Now we can stand to be a little more offensively minded. A little's about all he's gonna get. Get some more items. Stock up. Don't hit that thing again. Alright. I get a good feeling. We're gonna get through this. We can figure out how to turn this thing on. This is where we're supposed to go. Alright, so we hit this, and then, yeah. It's one of these puzzles. Oh, okay, so it's, it's one of these puzzles, but it's a little bit different. I don't understand the logic behind what I just did, but apparently I did it right. Bad feeling about this. Let's save. Just got this sense that something bad's about to happen when we hit that peg down. Haven't we met before? Dun dun ta. Then that means the Lady Lima upstairs. 
Ooh, Cacoletus theme. <laughs> Alright, I know I was hard on Cacoletta earlier, but um, she's, she's a pretty good villain, actually. Fastly run away! What does it mean? It's time for some exposition dump. It's another one of those items that can grant all your desires and stuff. Yep, that is Cacletta's ultimate goal. Let's see what their holding cell is like. Can't make me leave. Let's stock up real quick. We will save again because I am paranoid. I just discovered that my characters may in fact be severely underleveled, so... Whatever. Seems like an extremely good idea. Sounds bad. Whoa. Discuss the finer points of foreign policy. <laughs> Holy crap, the incredible Queen Bean Hulk. Okay, well, um, I guess it's time for a boss fight. I kind of wasn't ready, but sure, whatever. Got ten minutes, we'll take her. Alright, now her head's protected by that crown, so attacking her head on probably isn't the wisest plan. But if you wail on her arms long enough... Jeez. Whoa, hey, whoa! Uh oh. I get the feeling we might be cutting this episode short when I'm brutally slaughtered by this lady. Oh. Well, we gotta use him during the boss fight. Lady. Oh, jeez. I have this strange feeling we're in deep trouble right now. Now that we've knocked her crown off, she starts throwing up giant beans at us. Now, if you'll watch her hands very carefully, right before she attacks, she'll give away. That's her telegraph. Whichever hand she kind of twitches before attacking, that's who she's going to attack. Whichever hand is closest. Alright, now that we've got her crown off her head. It's time to get all bros on her. Yeah, that's some damage right there. Oh, no. 
Okay. Luigi. I forgot that happened. I feel like I came into this unprepared. Yeah. Totally, like, completely unready to do this, what I'm doing right now. I'll tell you what. Let's try the advanced version of the bro attack, because I don't think I did it right last time. Yeah, so you can attack multiple enemies. Bad. Let's just go all out. Let's try the level 3 advanced version, because that'll hit both of her arms, possibly. One-arm shockwave isn't as powerful, but it's a little bit faster. Uh -huh. Yeah, it's actually better not to land on them because that just spawns more enemies. Close to death, and he's kind of unhealed. Da! Stop landing on the beans! Alright, let's just go for Queen Bee. Now we gotta serum. Beefy arms. But luckily she kills the beanling, so she does that big beefy arm shockwave attack. Beefy arm again. Alright, let's try this one more time. That's how it's supposed to work. Flies. Yeah. You got that little bean onslaught. Now we can take her out. Maybe we can start landing some attacks. Sorry if this commentary is boring, I'm trying to win. Hmm. 
Oh, wait a minute. Now we have the advanced version for Splash Brothers. I might not get a chance to demonstrate this, but if you keep landing on those beans, um, she'll actually suck them up and regain her health. So that's probably why you don't want to do that. Alright, let's see what the advanced version is. It's kind of cool. Take this battle to long haul. Unless we start dodging attacks pretty quick. Alright, kind of row points filled out. I'm just gonna take this lady out. Not to dinner. Oh nice! Finally deflected that attack. This battle being hard, so I have no idea if we're close to beating her or not. Oh, uh. Yeah, here's the thing. Here's the thing. Whenever that happens, whenever one brother faints and the other brother gets attacked, uh, he picks up the other brother. But that can be bad because it makes them harder to. It makes dodging attacks harder. Shockwave attack. I hadn't been talking at all. Uh, I'm sorry, guys. I want to win. Okay, let's eat some nuts. Quick heal up. Okay, I need some syrup.
Yes! Got her. Whew. Whoop that queen bean. Take that, queenie. Ha! Oh, what? That's lame. Give me some more HP. That beach game. Tear me apart game. I don't even know what to buff on him anymore. HP, I guess. Yeah, there we go. 25. Transformation again, guys! Sure will. Spin up just a belly black worm. Drank Chocola Reserve. Huck Woods is our next destination. And Luigi immediately sits down and starts poking. Alright. Well, we took the... Well, it looks like, uh... Kekleta got the Bean Star. Lost right now. Okay, Kaleta got the Bean Star, but we managed to take the castle back. So that's good, I guess. Uh, I need to find a save spot. So we're relatively soon. I think we're running over. That battle took a lot longer than I thought it was going to. Here we go. Alright, that's it for this episode. Whew. God, that fight was rough. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you again next time.